Hi, this is Nicola Fox from Refoxology and today I'm going to talk to you about the oil blend which is Serenity. So this is another one of my favourite oils and I have this one at the side of my bed. Um, Serenity is great for supporting with sleep and helping to reduce stress and anxiety and help you calm, in, especially in, in an evening. Um, so I use this, I put a um, drop on my pulse points um, before I go to bed. You can also put drop and add it to the, the back of your neck or to your uh, temples. Uh, another good way that you can use it is a couple of drops in, add to a bath um, and have a nice warm bath um, before bedtime. Um, like lavender, you can add it to uh, water. Um, and spray on the pillow. Um, I have this in my diffuser which I have on in an evening at bedtime and not only does it help me get to sleep but I also feel that I have such a, a deeper sleep uh, with this so it is really a fab, fab oil to help um, if you do have issues um, and struggle to get to sleep. So the reflexes that um, we're going to support um, also sleep we're going to look at the spine that runs along your thumb and across the bottom of your wrist. And this all supports our nervous system. We've then got the adrenal gland, which is in the crook of the hand, um, kind of where the thumb, so in that dip in there. We've got the solar plexus, which is on the crease of the hand. If you come down the middle finger, it's literally on that crease of the hand there. We've also got the um, pineal, which is on the outside of your, of your thumb there, which helps to release uh, melatonin, which is great to help go to sleep. And we're gonna work all the tops of our fingers for the brain and the head area. So to start off with a little bit of oil or cream into your hands, add a drop of the oil and just massage it in and then we'll start with our three deep breaths so we're going to start with the spine on the right hand so ideally you want your hands on your lap um, and it's that nice and comfortable. You can maybe do this lying in bed or maybe do a couple of hours before you go to bed um, and then again once, once you're in bed. So we're going to use two fingers and going down the side of the thumb we're going to do kind of a circular motion and we're going to do five of those and then we're going to slide back up. So three down the side and two Across the wrist. So I'm just going to demonstrate three times. If you can do it five times, it'll really help kind of relax the, the spine and the nervous system. And then the same on the left hand. sliding back up good then we've got the adrenal gland so coming down and finding that dip in the hand just below the face of the thumb and we're just going to do nice gentle rotations I'm going to do five on each hand. Really think about the deep breathing as you do each of these. And the solar plexus. So down the middle finger to the crease of the hand. And again, just gently rotating, really focusing on calming and relaxing the body and the mind. And five on your left hand. And 
and we've got the pineal. So the easiest way to do this is to kind of grab your, your finger. It is on this side um, and then just kind of give a bit of a twist and then you can work, rub up and down. It's really about stimulating the area. So you might want to spend extra time on this if you do suffer with sleep issues. And the same on the other hand. So just give it a bit of a squeeze to start off with and then rotate or just strokes up and strokes down. So you're covering it's all the side of that thumbnail really. And maybe if you wake up in the night and can't get back to sleep, maybe that's the one that you really focus on working that, that pineal and releasing that melatonin. So then we're going to do the brain and the head area. I'm going to start with the thumb. It doesn't matter which finger that you start with. But nice big circles. You might want to use the side of your thumb just to get in a little bit deeper. And we do the same on each finger. So I'm doing about five circles on each one. Don't worry about the technique too much. It's about stimulating the reflex area and thinking about calming and relaxing. If you can change your mindset, thinking about calm and relaxing and switch off from everything else that's going on, that will really help with your sleep. And then to finish, massage in your hands and three deep breaths. Remember, check out my introduction for any questions um, regarding how to use the oil safely, especially for children. If you've got any questions about sleep, then please feel free to ask. Thank you. Bye.